So Team 10 is family. We are family. It's a group of people who live together. You can call it a squad if you want to. After Jake Paul would take inspiration from Dr. Dre to build his own collective influencers, all of whom would give Snoop Dogg and Eminem a run for their money. That, that was a joke, by the way. It's every day, bro, with the Disney Channel flow. Five mil on YouTube in six months. Never done before. After Team 10 would move into a $2.5 million Beverly Grove mansion, but then move to a $7 million mansion in Calabasas, because it's every day, bro. I want to be the first social media billionaire. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I mean, I wouldn't doubt you doing it, man. Oh, I, I'm going to. After Team 10 received at least $1 million in funding from the Chinese investment firm Denhua, as well as from other social media investors including Edward Lando, A. Burns, Adam Zeppelin, and Gary V. The future of Team 10 was looking so bright back in August of 2016. This rooftop trailer featured members Alyssa Violet, the Dobre Twins, and some other guy who I don't really recognize. I am loving them backflips though. God, they're good backflips. Now as you would know, Team 10 would quickly become a revolving door of new members as people kept quitting left, right, and center. Let's run through a list of the former Team 10 members. It's long. First up, we got Alyssa Violet. It was both of our faults, really. He shouldn't have treated me like sh day after day and then expect everything to be okay, and I shouldn't have stayed. Next up, the Martinez twins. The best backflippers in the game, the Dobre Twins. We just wanted to do what was best for Marcus and I career-wise. Do you remember AJ Mitchell? I'm not with Team 10 anymore, but I really do appreciate Team 10, everything they've done for me. There's also Max Beaumont, Niels Visser, and Alex Lang. The time has come for me to move on and move my career in another direction. Tessa Brooks, she was one of the, uh, well, one of the few females. She also, well, packed her bags. I just want to let you guys know that I am no longer in Team 10. There is Tristan Tails. Going into this new year, I will no longer be a part of Team 10. And more recently, Chance Sutton and Nick Crompton, well, they decided to leave the group. No, it's Nick Crompton and my corner stay open. Yes, I can rap and no, I'm not from Cotton. Now even Jake Paul himself has made the joke that it's literally Team 3. It's team 3. Team 3? It's, <laughs> it's Team 3. Okay, we're just... <laughs> <laughs> it's literally Team 3, guys. Okay, it's not exactly Team 3, but it's Team 7. And that includes a member who's only 9 years old and a dog named Apollo. Pretty rough. No pun intended. What's going on, guys? It's your boy, Michael McCredden, documenting the aftermath of Team 10, here for you on After They're Famous. Now, I'm actually a fan of Jake Paul's. At least I respect his hustle and for embarking on such an elaborate business plan. The dude certainly has some big cojones. And speaking of which, I was actually out last night with a friend who claims to have been the girl who took his virginity. She also stated that he cried over a bad case of blue balls. I don't know. What should I do with this information? Should I interview her on camera if she can provide proof? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Now let's get into this video. Hey, be sure to subscribe and hit that bell. Boom! Now Jake Paul was a social media influencer on the rise and a group of people got together deciding to invest in the young star. After a million dollars was deposited into a Team Dom account, well Team 10 kicked off in the summer of 2016. Guys, I just found out that we got a house. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. What's up? Now the first few members of the group moved into a five bedroom mansion. This included Alyssa Violet, the Dobre Twins, and soon after they were joined by Neil Visser, Alex Lang, and AJ Mitchell. Now this is the uh, initial group of Team 10, although there was only seven of them. And all these members, well they would soon after leave. Niels, he left to pursue modeling. Alyssa, she was kicked out. The Dobre Bros, they got homesick. AJ and Alex Lang, they just left. And uh, well, let's take a look at what these kids are up to today. As you all know, Alyssa Violet fell into the arms of Jake Paul's nemesis, Faze Banks. A similar business savvy social media star, he's the owner of the wildly successful gaming and YouTube crew, Face Clan. He's also got his own YouTube channel, his own LA mansion, which he shares with other YouTubers. And the two seem pretty happy to be together. Alyssa even April fools the world that the two were expecting a baby. The Dobre twins are killing it on both their own YouTube channel with 8.5 million followers and the one they share with their older brothers, which has almost 3 million subscribers. 
Now, not long ago, I actually did it before they were famous on The Boys. They all decided to work together and started up the Dobre Brothers YouTube channel on June 5th, 2017. We want to bring you guys in to the strength of our brotherly bond, and we want to make this kind of a channel where all the Dobre Army were all family and we can ride through life together. Now, that video didn't do so hot, and I'm still wondering why. Niels Visser, he has 2.8 million Instagram followers and has worked with some big brand names as a model. AJ Mitchell, he has 2 million combined on Instagram and YouTube, and he belts out some bangers. Actually, seriously, very talented kid. Baby, baby, can't you see? I got everything you need. As for Alex Lang, well, he's got 3 million combined on Instagram and YouTube, and he still regularly collabs with a lot of team tenors. Now, Jake Paul, he was initially receiving 20% off the income of the members. But uh, it appears the real winner himself were those who left Jake Paul. He stated, I found these kids online and they had 300,000 followers. Then I flew them out to LA and taught them how to do things on social media. In two weeks, they went from 300,000 to 400,000. And today they have 16 million. With Jake Paul being a surefire way to grow your social media clout, well, other members began joining left, right, and center. There was Tessa Brooks, his high school buddies Chance Sutton and Anthony Trujillo. There were also plenty of others including Tristan Tails, Stan Gurdon, Martinez twins and Drake Refield. Half of those kids I never heard of. Now the summer of 2017 was the height of fame for Team 10. Fans lined up outside their Beverly Hills home and neighbors compared to what was going on to being a war zone. When the local news showed up to report on the social media star, well this is what happened. Jake, I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't crawl up there. Why? Okay. I have one question for you. Yeah. What are those? Oh! The STEM made global headlines and turned the YouTube prankster into a social media villain. In fact, the newspaper quoted him as being a moronic menace to society. But you know how it goes. Good press, bad press, it's still press. And Jake Paul plus his team members, they were gaining massive notoriety. They dropped It's Everyday Bro on YouTube, which absolutely exploded. It's Everyday Bro with the Disney Channel flow. Five mil on YouTube in six months. Never done before. Pest all the competition, man. PewDiePie is next. For the remainder of 2017, Jake Paul and his brother Logan Paul, they seemed untouchable. And they dominated the YouTube landscape. Spoils were enjoyed, with Jake moving his crew into a much bigger pad. Despite all the success, not everyone was happy at Team 10, and members continued to drop out. Tessa Brooks, her exit was strangely mysterious, so let's check out what she's up to today. 5.7 million on Instagram and 3.5 million on YouTube, Tessa is doing A OK without the team. To a lesser extent, the same can be said about Tristan Tails, Stan Jarens, and Drake Refield. Now, it does appear that there was a new clause in the Team 10 contract because no one was talking shit following their exit from the group no more. I was so. I promise myself I wouldn't cry and I don't want to cry. Ugh. At the time of this recording, the existing members of Team 10 include Erica Costal, Kate Spicer, Chad Tepper, Anthony Trujillo, and Justin Roberts. Also, there is that nine year old boy, Ben Hampton, and the dog, Apollo. Even the dog has 2.2 million Instagram followers. Although I heard he's seriously sick of Jake's shit and he's planning to pull a homeward bound. Anyone here old enough to get that reference? <laughs> As for the Paul brothers, they dominated 2017 and 2018 will have brought them lots of trouble. Logan's trip to Japan turned arguably the most famous man in the world into a punching bag for traditional media. While Logan was dropped by Google Preferred, he also faded lawsuits regarding his merch brand and he began slowing down his daily vlog channel. And this, well, it resulted in a dip in views. Jake's channel continued to persevere, but it's not at its highest point when it was everyday bro. Now, according to my good friend Keemstar, it's Greg Paul, their father, who is tidying up their financials behind the boys' businesses, and this led to the departure of the fan favorites, Nick Crompton and Chance Sutton. You know, obviously, like it wasn't a great experience, but there were no hard feelings. You know, no one's mad at each other. So, will the Team 10 brand live on? They do have a summer tour kicking off, and they will be touching down in Toronto. Now, seeing as I've made an after their famous on Team 10, it's likely I shouldn't go. I mean. Well, huh, I do have a bunch of nieces and nephews, I could bring them, make 50 bucks a head? Eh, I don't need it. As for the rest of the story, well, we'll have to wait and see because this is After They're Famous. My name is Mike McCrudden, we make all sorts of celebrity bios here for you on this channel. We have an entire playlist dedicated to YouTubers that you should check out. Let us know who's next in the comments down below. I'll see you guys in another video. Also, Nick Crompton, if you're watching, I'm hiring. Yeah, bro.